Darts Nuts and welcome to Darts Review Channel. In this video I'm reviewing another set of the Shot Ronin Darts. This particular model is called the Makoto and this is the 23 gram version. You can also get them in 22 grams, 24 grams and 25 grams and also in soft tip in 18 and 20 grams and they're 90% tungsten dart and the retail for £64.95 so let's check them out. So as with the other Ronin darts the uh, come in a very neat slimline box and there's a little bit of a story on the back about the darts and the uh, theme and you got all the info on the front of the box. Inside there's a pull out uh, form tray holding everything in place and the darts are fitted with the uh, eagle claw stems I think they're in between size and you've got a set of uh, standard shape flights and underneath there you've got your barrel guarantee st certificate the darts are fitted with a black coated point and as you can see it's kind of a teardrop shape or spring onion style shape bulbous on the front and kind of tapers a little bit in the middle and then straight towards the rear and it's got a tapered nose and it's got a small section of the masonry grip and then you've got a fairly wide band and then more of the masonry grip and then you've got a section of kind of a shark style grip and then more of the masonry grip along towards the rear and then a small smooth section on the end of the barrel and again it's a very nice feeling grip and probably feels most comfortable around there because it sits in your fingers nice there and you've got your eagle claw stems and another nicely made set of flights and a nice um, pattern on them Again, following the uh, Japanese warrior culture theme, which is quite a nice theme. The data fit with the 30mm black coated point and it's got a kind of a bulbous nose, a slight taper to the front with a smooth section of 2.7mm and then a section of the masonry grip of 2.9mm and then you've got a smooth section of 3.3mm and then the widest part of the front is made of this masonry grip which is 10.8mm wide and then you've got a kind of a shark style ring grip which is 7.5mm and then you've got more of the masonry grip which is 16.8 millimeters and then a smooth section at the end of 6 millimeters length is 50 millimeters width is 7.3 millimeters .06 grams 23.06 again and 23.08 and the full setup is 24.59 grams it's quite a difficult one to balance but with nothing attached it's front weighted and with the supplied setup it moves to the center of the barrel and this is the balance with medium in between short extra short stems and standard flights a bit of spin there but I think it's just because it's quite a grippy dart and obviously it's quite chunky where I'm gripping it on the front and definitely has a, uh, a front weighted feel to it maybe almost a little bit too much um, but that grip itself it, it's quite a unique feel to the grip but maybe too grippy for some people And 
obviously it's kind of a unique uh, shape. It's not a shape that'll suit everyone, but definitely I think it feels most comfortable gripping it there around the middle. But it's slightly different grip there. It's more like a, a shark style grip, so I'll try it from there. Spin there, like that more keeps moving. I'm have to fix that. Yeah, it's one of them shapes that probably takes a while to get used to it. But I don't think it's a shape that is for everyone. Spring onion teardrop style. it's probably going to be more suitable for middle grippers if you like that kind of uh, front weighted feel so I try it from the rear now so I'm fully on the masonry grip on the rear can't believe that them three didn't spin at all <laughs> usually it spins a lot more when I try it from the rear grip Spin on that one. Definitely feels more front weighted there, throwing it from the rear. But if you're a rear grip that kind of likes that feel and you want something that's a bit more grippy, it's certainly good for that. Can't believe we actually got a treble from the rear grip. <laughs> So that's the shot Ronin Mercator. Um not really sure whether it's the kind of uh, barrel shape that I like. I know it's quite front weighted and I'm a front gripper, but I don't know. It's, um, sometimes we was getting a little bit fish taily, sometimes it was spinning a little bit, and the other time it was going quite smooth, so kind of a bit mixed for me personally. But for some front grippers, you might like that kind of uh, shape, so de definitely worth a look. But it certainly feels more comfortable gripping around that middle section. Um, but it still has that slightly front weighted uh, feel to it. But overall, it's probably more evenly balanced around there. And you've got that uh, kind of slope to push against, but it was releasing out my fingers uh, easy enough. And from the rear, it wasn't as bad as they expecting it to be, so it, it could work for some rear grippers. And once again, you're on that very nice masonry style grip. But like I said, it's quite a unique shape, so it's not a barrel shape that suits everyone. But uh, if you already know that you like this shape and you want something that's more grip to it, then it's certainly worth a try. But uh, once again, it's very nicely uh, made and great style of grip from shot. So that's the end of the review, thanks for watching.